So good afternoon everyone and welcome to yet another edition of My Currency Transfer TV. Today we're going to be discussing a term that is often, I would say, exploited by both airport bureaus, banks and even some of the more opaque currency companies, namely 0% commission. In a recent survey that we did here at My Currency Transfer, we found that an astonishing 60% of respondents actually thought that 0% commission on their currency meant that they were getting some type of free currency deal. Now, this is crazy. So I guess whether you're buying an overseas property or whether you're sending money to friends and family, you might be importing goods from abroad. The first golden rule is to treat 0% commission as a marketing gimmick because that's all it is. So I guess, you know, if you go to a market, there is a price for apples. There's a price for a banana and there's a price for buying some pears. So too, there is a price for sending currency abroad with or without these flashy sale, flashy slogans of 0% commission. Banks, brokers, airport bureaus, they're not in the business of giving away currency for free. So essentially, just treat these offers of 0% commission as marketing fluff. There's no transparency in 0% commission on your money transfer. So that probably brings us up to the next question of how do currency companies, banks and bureaus, how do they make money? And the key concept to understand is the wholesale rate plus markup. Now, they all make money in exactly the same way. They basically apply a markup to the wholesale exchange rate. Now, the tighter the markup, the better the deal. The wider the markup, the worse the currency deal. Simples. Now, I guess individuals and businesses that are sending money abroad are only able to know the true cost of their currency conversion by actually being able to calculate the difference between the real rate of exchange and the exchange rate that they're being offered which we call the sell rate. It's a very key concept to understand, the wholesale rate plus the markup. So the next time that you transfer money abroad, you know, what we would suggest is to be aware of the real exchange rate. And this can be found on most major news channels. And if you download any number of currency conversion apps, have this to hand the next time that you transfer money abroad. And when you're being quoted, whether it be over the phone or online, you know, an increasing number of currency brokers actually let you now trade online. Use that real exchange rate as a point of reference to understand exactly how much you're, you're paying on your next international payment. So yeah, be aware of the mid-market exchange rate. Now, you know, what we love and what's so pleasing to see in, in the market at the moment is a huge wave of, wave of innovation and definitely a growing wave of transparency where forward-thinking currency businesses are moving towards providing full disclosure on, you know, the wholesale rates, um, the markups that are applied to the um, mid-market exchange rate or the rate that that currency broker is buying in the currency at um, and actually guaranteeing you that rate, you know, for a certain period of time. Um, at my currency transfer, we completely um, buy into this, this concept towards more innovation in this space. We embrace this movement um, and we think ultimately it will help customers find a fairer and ultimately cheaper money transfer deal. So that's it for today. It was all about 0% commission. It's a marketing gimmick um, and just treat it as marketing fluff when you are sending money abroad next. Really enjoyed this one, very important um, episode of My Currency Transfer TV. If you want to get in touch or you have any more questions, feel free to tweet me. I'm at Dan underscore currency. You can email me directly, daniel at mycurrencytransfer.com. And really looking forward to seeing you all next week. Have a good one.